rosy kishi today i'm going to be sharing with you guys how i make my ogbola soup so guys sit down relax and follow me and see how i make this my ogbola soup from the scratch here are the things we are going to need to make this ogbola you will need ogbola these two cup of ogbola you need pepper crayfish salt this is no cube margin you can use any seasoning maggi you want these onions i'm going to use these onions to boil out the meat this palm oil this kale leaf and this is bitter leaf leaf dry one and this is the meat i'm going to use this beef and uh, uh, beef i'm going to use the beef and the um, cow skin and this is macro fish this smoky macro fish i did this one myself i smoked the fish myself so guys you need this smoking fish in your bolo even if you don't have a lot of meat so but you need this dry macro fish so these are all the things we are going to use to make this soup so guys let's start doing it here yeah, i'm going to i'm going to boil the meat boil the meat hot now so this is salt just add a little salt on it. There's no mango. There's no seasoning. So I'm adding it. So I'm going to allow the meat to boil out of its own juice first. So before I can add water to it. So I'm going to allow the meat to cook about like about 20 minutes or 25 because it has a uh, cow skin. So I would just want to wait for, I'll have to wait for it to be wet cooked. So I'm going to wait like about 25 to 30 minutes before I can add any other thing to it right now. It has boiled out with its own juice. So I'm going to add water to it now. I'm going to add water. I'm adding pepper. Yeah. You can add as much pepper as you want, as your mat can handle. So we, we eat spicy food, so I, I like it when it's spicy. Especially your bolo soup has to be spicy. Just allow it to boil out if I can add the bolo to it. So I'm going to add palm oil to the bolo, the grounded bolo. So. I'm going to add in three years so that it will melt the ogbolo. The oil will melt and we heat the ogbolo, then I mix it together. So I'll just have to wait. Wait for them. Uh, until I see that the oil is already hot and the ogbolo is already mixed. So I'll just have to check it out. Okay. Yes, it's time to wash the fish.
using your smoky macro fit inside umbrella oh my god you'll be feeling feeling something the palm oil here is already met so i'm just going to turn it You can uh, you can as well the, depends on the way you like it though. You can as well just turn the powder inside your water when it's already boiled out. You can turn your your color powder inside and add your oil in, palm oil inside. But I prefer doing it this way though. So I don't really know why. But all the same, anyhow you like it, you can do it. So you can still do it like this the way I put my oil inside. So. So I'm going to have your blow inside right away. So I don't want to add the fish right now, so I just have to wait because I don't want the fish to melt inside. So I will add the leaf later. Yeah, see us up below the bubble. So I'm going to have the leaf to eat right now. The macro fish, the smoky macro fish, will be the last to put because. I don't want to be looking for it inside my bowl of soup, so I'm just going to add a leaf to it. I'm going to add this black dry uh, bitter leaf to it because I want to feel the taste of this the taste of the the leaf in, inside just a little though so like about five minutes then i'll have the fish to it and our soup will be ready so i'm going to be adding the fish now Guys, it's ready. The bolo is wet, cooked now. Now it's just for us to eat, serve it, and eat. Hey guys, our bolo is ready. So guys, thank you for watching to the end. So if you are new to my channel, this is Rosie Kitchen. Please do press the notification button. Anytime I upload a new video, you'll be notified so thank you guys for watching and those of you that have already subscribed thank you thank you so much so guys see you thanks for watching bye